Uh, it was, um, I mean, I think we were um, completely blown away by the scale. Um, we had um, more than 4,000 cities and towns that, that, that actually registered to take part around the world. And, you know, some of those amazing icon buildings or structures like the pyramids or the Eiffel Tower um, happened. And I know there was a street party in Mexico City. And, uh, you know, the world seemed to embrace the idea that um, uh, for, for one, one hour, at least, they had a voice. And I think that uh, our job with Earth Hour and the kind of the whole idea of voting for Earth, you know, voting your light switch, that needs to be taken forward over the next six months. And we hope that people who took part in Earth Hour will be part of um, a very positive campaign going forward to uh, to Copenhagen, reminding our leaders that there is a mandate, a mandate, a big, big mandate for change. We estimate that more than half a billion people took part in Earth Hour, which would make it the... Um, probably one of the biggest, um, you know, uh, mass participation uh, actions uh, ever to have happened um, voluntarily. And, um, you know, uh, that says something in itself. You know, that's amazing that many people care enough to do something, even if it's just for an hour.